Welcome to the Trustee Library's online tutorial for finding articles in databases. When you search for materials, start broad and narrow it down from there. Type your term or terms in the text box and click the search button. You'll see a lot of results listed in the body of the page. Use the options on the left side of the results to start narrowing them down. Use the Full Text checkbox to view only results that include an attachment of the entire article. Databases often include citations and abstracts in addition to entire articles, so this makes sure you only see the items that you can read immediately. Use the Scholarly or Peer-Reviewed Journals checkbox to view only results that are from academic, peer-reviewed publications. If you select this, you'll see only articles from scholarly publications that your instructor will respect. Use the Publication Date option to select an appropriate date range for the results you would like to view. In some cases, your instructor may ask you to retrieve articles from only the last five years or even the last three years. The more recent, the better. Another handy tool is Subject Thesaurus Term. This appears when you have a great number of results and will show you a variety of additional terms that are related to your search. Some terms are more relevant than others. Click the terms that apply to your particular research and the database will remove articles that do not fit those terms. Another way to narrow things down is to use Boolean search techniques to modify your search. If you're looking for two related terms, type AND, capital A-N-D, into the search box between those two terms. This tells the database that you want to see only articles that include both of those words. Or, capital O, capital R, can be helpful for telling the database that you would like to see articles with either of the two terms that might be used by article authors. In this case, like saying endangered or rare. You can also type not, capital N, capital O, capital T, between two terms to tell the database that you want to specifically exclude certain topics that might use the same word. In this case, typing Bears Not Chicago will exclude the sports team from your results. One more tip. For a specific phrase, put quotation marks around it. This lets the database know to keep those two specific words together as one item. Need any more help? Ask a librarian at liveanswers.bernau.edu. Was this video helpful? We appreciate your feedback. Click the quiz here and let us know.